is Oblisk. Let me just double check. This is Oblisk 7. Um, yeah, you got the Nano versus Snatch Steel. Um, yeah. Um, so it looks like the Nano is on his version of Chaos Turbo. Let's have a look. Um, let's see. I mean, and it looks like Snatcher was using Warriors. Um, yeah, let's, let's. Let's. Okay, fine. I wouldn't be surprised if that set card was actually a morphing job, but let's see. It's the coin. Probably gonna be the coin chain. So don't mind me whilst I type up um, Yeah, poke for 14 mm. Yeah, I missed some for sure, I missed the start of the game Yeah, yeah we can see that Now we can go strong Okay, so it looks like Snatch Steel is on his version of Warriors, which main decks is on Blade of the Dark. So, if I'm, I wouldn't be surprised if I see a counter to represent that. So Let's just have a quick glance at the bracket. So, yeah, it's obviously 7. Um, don't copy in Templar Pat played earlier, and uh, don't copy one it so whoever wins of this of this will be from Italy. Um, if you hear any background music in the background, uh, I do apologize. I've got the window open. <laughs> it's quite toasty. Oh, found the drip pit. Um, so, hmm. Let's see. So, yeah, unfortunately, it looks like he's looks like this snatch deal is telegraphing a torrent. Looks like he's telegraphing some judgment. But yeah, you normally wouldn't. You normally would let priority go through. You know that you got Thunder Dragon. Yeah, there we go. There comes a the chaos horse. Well, yeah, we should have expected that. <sighs> yeah, that's a bit. That's quite rough because that was the dog. If Snatch still had the chaos monster in hand, yeah, that's the dog. Uh, yeah, so decoratory. I'm poking for 14. Yeah, I'm. Chaos horse in an attack to play around Ninja Master, Master Sasuke. Yeah, even though it walks into a mill, and there's a dust tornado. 
Um, hätte ich vielleicht noch nur Kossout. I guess it's gonna be attack over set monster in the type of game. Ooh, we have another bluff nobleman, but we still have mirror force and Sakuretsu armor. Let's see, we're gonna see one or both of them. There's the Sakuretsu armor. Do we have another one? And the Nano takes it with his version of Chaos Turbo. Snatch your brain first. Let's see. Yeah. Who are going viewers? Ooh. Yeah, we've got a party here. Uh, we've got a couple guys from uh, Go Colonia. Um, shout out to the guys. Uh, snatch to <laughs> is one of the guys from um, Copolonia, so yeah, shout out to everyone on the channel or in the Discord watching their teammate, friend. Yeah, search Blade Knight, um, interesting, um, yeah, quite <laughs> Yeah, that's the reason why. Yeah, a bit unusual um, for me, um, just based upon me playing Warriors a little bit. Um, yeah, um, but it makes sense. You obviously want to thin the deck first uh, before you play Pot of Greed, but at the same time, Rota is, with also the army, is such a good toolbox card. Um, Normally you would want to save it for whatever your opponent has, but yeah, like I mentioned, you have pots. So I think the deck makes sense. Right. 
Ooh, very strong. Let's see what let's see what he draws into and what he discards. I wouldn't be surprised if we dump the light in the dark. But let's see what what the discards are gonna be. Hmm, interesting. Um, yeah, I guess that makes sense. Wow, we have more deck failing. Um, yeah, that sets up a dark with that Blade Knight in hand to go for if if there's a Chaos Monster in the deck. Um, yeah, quite interesting to, to pitch these. Yeah, let's see what the Nano has brought in. Fires off an upstart of his own. The nano matching the three back rows that Snatch Steel has set. Um, wouldn't be surprised if I saw a dust tornado flipped right now, but let's see what let's see what Snatch Steel has to is going to decide on. <laughs> close enough. MST hitting the one close to the deck. Is it the solemn? What is it gonna be? Or is it gonna be a wing blast or some? Let's see. Ooh! So, for those that aren't aware, um, the Nano norm normally plays this version of Chaos Turbo, and if you've seen his list from previous events, he does side a small warrior package. Um, yeah, let's... Let's see. Let's see what the set monster is. Um, I'd be surprised if... Oh, I'd be surprised. I wouldn't be surprised if it was a warrior monster trying to break up that late night, but let's see what let's see what happens. Exile of course gonna kill the set monster with priority. And yeah, it was a warrior lady. Ticket is gonna swing for a sixteen. Let's see. Let's see what okay. And down comes the skill dark. I believe we got yeah, we got the DD Warrior Lady as a light, so He's going to have to let that throw. And MST, interesting. He can go for the... This, that is a solid. Yeah, so... <laughs> peop, some people tend to... not shuffle their hand and... and then they tend to set the solid in a predictable manner. Um, yeah, let's see if it's going to get no with that. That's what I'm <laughs> Same difference. Are we gonna, are we gonna see a Chaos Monster? So there comes a Nidoria. Let's see what the last card in hand is. A little bit of luck, I guess. Ooh, that's big. That's the BLS. That's the that's that Chaos Monster. That's that Chaos Monster that that we. We suspected that Snatch Steel had. 
Um, based upon his rotor search and discard for charity. And down goes the breaker. Are we going to see Torrential here? Class enough. Book of Moon. Yeah, that was quite. Not really too much. And that could have done. Do a kind of help. But let's see this. Let's see what set months is going to be. So, Exile Force is going to kill the set monster. Thought, thought as much. Um, yeah. That's a bit rough. Um, let's see if it's gone. Yeah, it's always going to be. Uh, not surprisingly, the nano scoops after getting. After the opponent drawing lots of cards and thinking their card deck card a lot. I don't copy. <laughs> yeah. Looks like both players have got a little bit of lag. Um, so they've had to refresh and they've taken advantage of uh, Julian Brooks' 90 second rule of. Yeah, 90 second rule that they implemented a, a few months back. Um, so you can refresh the page, go back in. Yeah. Uh, once again, I apologize for the music in the background. Yeah, it's, <laughs> it's pretty hot. 23 at 20. Oh, it's currently showing it's 23 Celsius um, on my computer screen. So, <laughs> yeah, you got people enjoying enjoying the weather. And the Nano is done with his side entry. Interesting. Um, And unsurprisingly, the nano chooses to go first. Let's see, the nano can open strong like it did in game one with uh, Thunder Dragon Pot of Great. Yeah, as we know, the Nando's uh, running Song Judgment. Um, I wouldn't be surprised if we had 
Well, I'd be surprised if he had a monster happy hand, but could be that he's just setting a monster. Trying to bait up, bait up the bunch of bunch of anti set cards that the warrior deck normally runs. Is he gonna discard the flip? Wow, not bad, not bad. <laughs> So yeah, um, yeah. Normally, the oh, I'd be surprised if that wasn't the Crow Troop because you wouldn't normally set it since it dies to Blade Knight runs over it. So yeah, I guess. Hmm. Yeah, I guess the hand must not be very strong for him to. <laughs> I just put that. Here. Yeah, I'm just I'm just checking to see if Yeah, I'm just checking to see if you can <laughs> awesome. So yeah. Cool. Thanks for tuning in. Um Ah, okay. So are we gonna see Blade now? We, I think I we're we gonna see Blade now or are we just gonna go straight for Mystic Floors and then run over the set monster? Interesting. So it does go for the blade now. Let's see what. He's made probably make a read that that. Hmm. I guess setting serpent isn't too bad either. Yeah, it's one of the things I've learned recently. Um, just set the serpent if you're playing turbo. Uh, to to beta all these pesky. Anti set monsters like Blade Knights, Mystic Swordsman, even Beta and Nobleman for your flip effects to go off. Interesting. Yeah. Ooh. Looks like Snatch Deal also has a similar issue with the monster Heavy Hand going to set the Smashing Ground. Yeah, in this case, you probably wouldn't want to set, set a card to go with the Breaker anyway, in case of Snatch Steel, I know it's a limited card, but you always have to take that into account when there's lots of these limited cards. Probably thinking, can, should I draw the Chaos Monster? Who knows? Yeah, that Breaker. Putting Snatch Steel in a little bit of an awkward situation if he drew the trap cards. Uh, let's see how he's going to go ahead. Where is it? Ah, uh, damn it. Like this. <laughs> you have to excuse me, I'm not used. Yeah, maybe if you're able to, we can play the final. Yeah, so uh, let me let me check. Um, I'll just respond to your messages. Don't copy. Um, um so um. I'm just, I'm testing out the stream um, to see if my internet connection will be okay because the last time I did, I'll actually I'll respond back. Um, um, so I just put that in. Interesting. So I wouldn't be surprised if that's the serpent again. Um, Just put there. We'll need to check with um. Uh, 
Cool. Yeah, so far so good. Um, maybe because I put the um, maybe I put the delay a little bit um, less. I put about half, about thirty seconds this time around. So, so far so good. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see if this will um, hold up. We need to voice chat at some point. I think they'll copy. <laughs> That'll be pretty cool. Maybe I'll, yeah, I'll, I'll, ooh, and my doodling book has gone kaput. Let's see. Yeah, my internet's okay. Sorry about this. Um, Yeah, I'm probably going to have to refresh and go back into the game. But let's see. Um, Ooh, that's rough. Um, Huh, that's going to be interesting because we've got... We are dead. Let's see if I can get back in via yeah, my connections. No. I mean, like, you can see the bracket, and you know, I'm sure you saw just now, you can see me loading up PPC, fine. So I think there's going to be an issue with um, doing book. Let's see if I can load up another web page. And we're good with YouTube. Yeah, just a common page that I go to, see if we'll get it. Um, yeah, don't mind me, don't mind me. Okay, let's see if they are back in. Um, nah, it looks like they've disconnected. And both of them have disconnected at the same time. Let's see if I can get back into the game. Oh dear, not this again. Yeah, it's dead. Um, let's see if I can find them. You, like I said, you're going to have to excuse me whilst I try and get back into the game, but it looks like it's dead. Let's see if I can get back into the game. Um, fingers crossed. I'll probably do a quick dual review of the... Um, of the parts that I missed, so this start turn, um, yeah, you can see it. Don't copy. You you can see you can see that. <laughs> Look at how long it's taking for me to get back into the duel. Ah, oh. yeah. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. I think. I think tonight is probably not a good night. Now's now's what four four p.m. Eastern time. And it looks like we're back in. Let's see. Let's see how we're going to do this. Because, yeah, yeah. obviously, um, Zombie is 1900. I'd expect that set card to be... Actually, it could be Dekoichi, now that I think about it. Um, yeah. <laughs> I wouldn't be surprised. I actually wouldn't be surprised if that's Dekoichi as well, because you've got a dog. But, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Didn't realize that until just now. And yeah, big swing from Gorilla. Um, um yeah. <laughs> you probably you probably know what's going on. <laughs> Don't copy. Yeah. Um Um, past turn, unsurprising. Um, let's see. Oh. 
Well, at least I think I do. So yeah, um, let's see who else is in it. So yeah, looks like we're back up, back in, back, back in business. Mm. So set two. T set from the nano. I wouldn't be surprised if he had the serpent again, but let's see. I see what he's got. Uh, so yeah, the gorilla and snatch you going for the all out approach, trying to swing for 3k. Um, assuming that set monster is the serpent. Not a very, very good magician, but I guess that's for that. That for me is signaling that he's got a chaos monster in hand. So let's see what. So, Snatchnail just going all out, attacking for the three k. I guess MST is pretty good in this spot. Um, I think he's made. The Nano's probably made a read that Snatch Deal's got a lot of monsters in hand, so whatever gets set is likely to get blown away by MSC, and yeah, unsurprisingly. Uh, unsurprisingly, Snatch Deal has passed turn. Let's see what he's had. Yeah, he hasn't really had much. Hasn't really had much to go on. No trap cards so far. Hmm, let's see. Ooh, the the sneaky trick. Um, yeah, the nano. Prefers Phoenix Wing Wing Blast in his um, in his Chaos Turbo build, and obviously that's very strong with the Serpent. Use Serpent again. Add the Serpent back to hand. I uh, wouldn't be surprised if if we saw a Chaos Monster here. Or that, yeah, fifteen hundred. Clear the beast. I guess I yeah. I guess he's going to probably. S Let's see what he does. Let's see what the man does. I wouldn't be surprised to be set any card to, to... Oh, set two. So MST and well, I'm I'm assuming it's gonna be MST and the real card. And Sangha gets drawn again. Let's see if we see the Chaos Master now. <clears throat> we haven't seen MST. I don't think we've seen MST or Breaker from Snatch Deal's part, but he does have a Chaos Water. So he wanted to play it safe, he'd, just, he'd go Chaos Source with Banish. Banish Tribe, but yeah, let's see what he does. I'm surprised he normally summons that. Ah, uh, okay, so summon the grill. 
That's going to bait out the MST, surely? Surely that's going to bait out the MST. You need to declare the targets. I uh, wouldn't be surprised if Gorilla was the target, to be honest. You need. Um, yeah, he needs to be able to put the pressure on. Not sure he wants to finish the game as soon as, as soon as he can. Especially when both players have been had the best of hands on to see a few back row. Hmm. Um yeah, he probably doesn't have the MST sets, although he probably have flipped it. Actually, never mind. Yeah, okay, so the another thing that he said I take it from what I I'm guessing that the Nano said that I've got lag and I'm still thinking when it comes to burial. Let, I don't have the log. Um I can't see the log. I'll um yeah, so what yeah. Yeah. Yeah, so yeah, so the nano says that he's had a bit of lag and he wanted to think upon the activation of burial because yeah he didn't I don't um yeah, I think if the guys want want to ask someone they can ask me, but from what I I'm gathering is that what the nano has said is that I have a bit of lag and when you activate the Prenatal Burial and want to revive the Berserk Gorilla, I'm thinking on the activation. So now we, we're still in main phase. I wouldn't be surprised if that's a, something to protect the tribe. Um, Solemn would be pretty good in this spot, but let's see. Could could be any other traps that we are seeing Phoenix Wing Wing Blast. Could be Mail Force. Well, I think Mail Force would. Yeah, you'd be forced to Mail Force here if it's a Chaos Monster. And there comes a the Chaos Monster. But which one? Is it going to be BLS? Try to swing for game? Or is it going to be the Chaos Sorcerer? Let's see. It's probably thinking on the position. Like, yeah, we knew that Chaos Monster was there. It's just a matter of. Where, how is it going to be dropped to the field? Which one is it? There's the sorcerer playing around the middle force as expected, which means that for me it's probably a wing blast or something to. Um, yeah, it's, it's probably a wing blast, I reckon. But let's see. Let's see what gets set. Because now, now Snatch Steel is a bit on the safe side, he can now afford. He can now set his card, now that MST is being used on the Permitted Burial, and he does exactly that. Serpent, I wouldn't be surprised if um, he's probably going to say I'm thinking, let's see, interesting, so neither player has, neither player has, yeah, I'm surprised to not see the dust shoot, but Interesting. Let's see how this. So. Yeah, it's, um, that set card um, is probably likely to be a wing or a male force. Let's see what it. No, it's not going to be used by now. Is it torrential? Let's see. Has to be torrential mirror for set. And having the solemn set for snatch deal would be pretty good. Ah! Not this again. Right. Okay, that's fine. Let's see if I can get back into the game quickly. Uh, the nano. Okay, proceed to battle phase. There's the one respects the mirror force. Let's see. I wouldn't be surprised when Nano said there's a bit of lag because I've. <laughs> Unsurprisingly, the mirror force gets flipped here.
Is the song going to get flipped here? So now we get to sign again search. Um, yeah, I wouldn't like. Here's the awkward bit. You, you could go for Warrior Lady. Because it's likely that set monster is going to be uh, Serpent. You don't really want to. Here's the awkward spot. Like, you don't really want to go, f go for Exiled here if you're reading that as a snake, which I am. Let's see what Snatch Deal searches off the Sangin. So he does go for the Exiled Force. Okay, so plan here is to sack off the set monster and kill the set monster. Just attack. Um, call the Haunted, I guess? Ooh, let's see. Is this the time where... Interesting. Yeah. Wow. Has he got the faith set? What's he got in graveyard? Yeah, he's got chaos monster. Chaos fodder. Let's see if he's gonna drop. Yeah, it's, it's awkward because you know, you well at least snatch is gone, but you have to respect that exiled force that may deal with the chaos monster. And surprisingly, that's a step For me, that's a serpent. Interesting. So yeah, he hasn't flipped it. Uh, yeah, because if it was a it was a flip, it'd be flipped straight away. So for me, that's going to be um. That's going to be a, a ser the serpent. Let's see if if that still tops the double mercos up. Let's see if I'm sorry, I've just I've, I've just been focused on the cave, so yeah. Um Let's see. I won't So Yeah, heavy stone would be pretty good here, even if it burns I wouldn't be surprised if the Nano decides to summon the Exile Force. Unsurprisingly. Ooh! Wow. So, Exile and Tribe. That's quite a big hit. He's still got the Serpent set. Is that going to be. Um, I'd be surprised if that were a Morphin Jar, but. Let's see. Attack over which one though? Let's see, he's got Chaos Fodder still. So Wing Blast is not gonna do much against Chaos Saucer. Um come stand by face. Interesting. Let's see. Upstart giving He's so yeah. At the moment, it's just hopefully the game's going to gone a lot slower. Um, then now just sitting it out. Likely to have a song set. Um, let's see. But now both players are almost halfway through their decks, so yeah, they're likely to draw more of their trap cards. Let's. Thunder Dragon would be pretty good for Mana right now, but nope, he doesn't draw it.
Hmm. Yeah, he's got. Once that BLS hits. Yeah, once the BLS hits the board, that's going to be very, very tough. With other solid. And there comes the Borg. And he's going to hit the new set monster. But is he going to say, yeah? So he's talking the new set monster. Ooh, Cypher Soldier, Kinetic Soldier. Yeah, surprised I've seen that, but I guess. Yeah, yeah, just. Interesting to see that. Uh, so now I take it we have the serpent set. Is he going to attack over the serpent or is he going to leave it be? Yeah, he's going to leave it on the board. He's so good to leave it on board so that so that the wind lost and travity are not live. Well, not as good, I should say. Duo's gone. So, uh, not really much point to play on the duo from the Nile's point of view. Which, yeah, I, re I remembered that. It's nice to have to punch you. So now we're just having a back row face off. And yeah, the Nano has to do something because he's done on life and he's lucky. He's the one who's done it for more potential for decking out. Um, let's see, we're gonna see the let's see if the heavy is gonna be played. Yeah, so yeah, then let's see what's So he's, yeah, I've got it down as Snatch Shield versus the Nano. <laughs> oh, wow. Let's see what he's going to get grab back of the. No, just say that. There's a second wing blast. Um, so, depending on the hand, yeah, given that we're so late on in the game. Well, I, I think, yeah, um, Snatch Steel is probably best place to leave. Yeah, he's probably best place to leave the, let the wing glass go through, but at the same time, if, if he lets it go through, then he can't tribute. He's got no tribute fodder unless he unless one of the set cards is called the Haunted. <sighs> yeah, unsurprisingly, we see a Solemn. Here comes a Solemn. And that for me suggests, um, yeah, someone needs to tell Snatch Steel to harp to bring him. There we go. There we go, so um, see the Nano playing around the potential trap dust shoot by setting a card before he before he uses Thunder Dragon. Um, but he's in the yeah, the nano's in a bit 
of the awkward situation uh, because now he's got five fields back rows and his only discard is now yeah he, he he's got his only discard card left in the deck. He's used up tribe. Has he? No. Yeah, he's used up tribe. He's got graceful charity and card destruction left. So let's let's see how the nano is going to open up a zone to be able to take advantage of those cards. I wouldn't. Yeah, come the next standby phase, I wouldn't be surprised if the nano decided to not get back since the serpent. Um, not get back since the serpent um, to play around the trap dust shit. Long game. Let's see. So you see here, he's thinking to see whether he wants to grab at the serpent. So that's one out of six solemns that we've seen today. Well, seen in this game. Yeah, so. The nano kind of had to do something here, otherwise he's at risk of decking out. And I'll be back. And Unsurprisingly, the nano decides to play around trap dust shoot. Um. Yeah. So is yeah. Like I said, it's awkward because the Nano's got no room to be able to to play any to play any back row. So let's, we see a Sakuretsu armor. I think that I think that Snatch Steel. Ooh, he goes for it. I think Snatch Steel had to let that go, but so here's here's a, here's a bit. we is now is now end of attack declaration. So if the Nano has got something else that can be used, any other quick effects. So a book of, if he kept Book of Moon in, you can use that. Or if he's got Ring of Destruction. Hmm. Yeah, and then he's obviously I don't know if the Thunder Dragon. But I wouldn't be surprised if they now had multiple solemn judgment. So now does I think the nano has is still eaten up. This time it only goes for the serpent. Let's see if we see a trap dust shoot now. Wow. Yeah, because you, here's the thing. Um if the nano yeah If the Nano um, wanted to, yeah, he's not going. Yeah, we knew we knew those two. So no more graceful chosen nonsense. But who knows? Who knows? We could be magician of faith set. Yeah, we know, we know, yeah, so, yeah, so, interesting, because, yeah, the Nano, obviously, playing a little bit of mind games here, where, um, so, yeah, the Nano is voluntarily con confirming that the other card in his hand was Ring, um, yeah, because you don't forget that, technically speaking, the Snatch Shield had to wait for the Nano to say, 
Um, okay, your first chapter should I don't have anything in response to this first one. Um, but we, as we saw, um, as we saw, Snatch Deal flipped both of them straight away without asking for a response, which yeah, is understandable because you don't get you don't get another chance because it would have gone down to the Nana would have gone down to three cards in hand if the first one resolved. But let's see. There's the Magician of Faith. Um, are we going? To, I don't think. I don't think we'll see a third Solemn here. Um, but yeah, it were. Oh, we do have the third Solemn. He's thinking whether he wants to negate it, but it's for me. It's quite obvious that the Nano has got at least one Solemn set, if not more. But let's see, like. In this situation, Snatch Steel is a game, so probably you're digging for more cards with Pot of Breed. Um, yeah. So, yeah, the, the Snatch Steel is. Let's see what Snatch Steel's got left in this graveyard. Oh, yeah, so it's likely to be solemn given that he's asked to say thinking about a flip summon. You normally wouldn't. Your best bet here would be to. Yeah. So he's at least Snatch Deal is communicating. I mean, both players know that he's he's likely to have a solemn set. Um, we've got no Chaos Monster, so yeah, I think I think the line of play here is is. Um, yeah, it's very awkward because unless, unless, yeah, unsurprisingly, there's the third solemn. Are we going to see a solemn from? Are we going to see the solemn from the middle? There we go. That's it. So yeah, I wouldn't be surprised if the Nana had another set card. He's got to go for um, pots at this stage because yeah, he's got no. He has to use pot at this stage. He's got no choice because um, yeah, he can't really play for MST. Uh, yeah, if it was another dust shoot, then it would have been flipped straight away. Um, there's the snatch steal. I wouldn't be surprised if we saw another solemn, solemn to stop whatever snatch steal had, or if snatch steal says good game here. Um, Okay, so um, so Snatch says, how come you set, from what I gather, how come you set this Snatch and activate? I'm assuming it's a misclick, but even then, if it's the only cards, the only spell cards that you can't use the turn they are set are quick play spells. Yeah, so... Um, interest. So, I'm not sure. Sh can someone, can someone put, put it out there that um, that flipping snatch steel is legal. I guess they have resolved the issue. Uh, I wouldn't. Uh, Dust tornado set. I guess Dust tornado MST. There we go. But do we see the unsolemn? There we go, and that's the game wrapped up. Unsurprisingly, so that was. Yeah, that's very good. Very well. Very. Well played by the Nano for me. Um, I don't know if 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 don't copy and snatch shell gonna play right now. Uh yeah, interesting. So yeah, so so the Nano always have this under control. The Book of Moon would. I'm surprised he set the card destruction, but I guess he was worried about deck out and he was waiting for the right opportunity to activate the card destruction, but the trap dust shoot removed all the monsters that uh remove all the monsters that were going really well with the card destruction, namely Night Sent and Sensor Serpent. Um Yeah, and he always had the book as well, so if for whatever reason uh and ring to draw the game if necessary, like Let's see if there's pot. Um, yeah, pot wasn't used. 
Um, so yeah, I don't know if I'm gonna ask the nan. I'm, I'm gonna s yeah. I'm just going to. <laughs> so uh, you up now? I don't copy. <laughs> So yeah, they're having a, I guess they're having discussion. Yeah, um, it's a weird build because Snatch Deal wasn't too happy to. He wasn't too happy to um, with the list because he's running some Borg in the main deck, uh, and he was like, "No, nah, I made a mistake here." But he unfortunately, he submitted the deck list. Um, he's done very well to get. Let's see, he's still got another match with Don't Copy, so let's see how he, he does that. Um, yeah, he's gonna have, someone's gonna have to admit defeat, but I've already, um, I've already updated the... Oh, so I'm gonna save the replay. So let's, let's just have a quick glance at the replay, both of them. Uh, let's see if they're leaving. Uh, yeah, so, the Nan always had this, um, I guess Snatch Deal was a bit too... Rash with the solemn judgments. Um, I guess he was trying to bait out the nano into using the solemn, but uh, yeah, the nano was so patient and yeah, just held on to those solemn judgments for when he really needed them. So, yeah, really good games. Let's see who's up next. Yeah, so. Um, you're gonna have to excuse the name of the video, so I just I'll just change the name of the video to um, yeah I'll just update the title now, so it's not gonna it's gonna be so I'm just gonna rename this um, until yeah um, good games let's see let's see who let's see if they're playing right now they could decide to not play and I'll see when they play so that I can actually cover it for you guys yeah um, let's see if the guys are going to agree to do something um, There we go. So yeah, I've reported that. So I'm just going to. So bear me the second. Let's see if they're going to play it now. Um, yeah, it just depends on whether uh, whether Snatch Deal wants to play right now or whether he wants to play another time. Let's see. Yeah. So. Nothing yet, we just we gotta wait and see if Snatch Deal agrees to uh, agrees to um go <laughs> agrees to play now. Okay. So they wanna play. Cool. So I'm just going to wait for the stream. Um yeah. So yeah, um, if you want if you want to listen, uh, by all means you're free to listen. But please don't copy. But please, um, you know, disconnect from. Make sure you're not viewing. I'm more than happy to. Yeah. More than happy to keep you on. <laughs> um. So time to change this. Um. So I got it all wrong. I'll put it to um. So that was winners finals and now we've got losers finals. So I'm good hopefully by the time the video goes up. I should <coughs> excuse me. 
Excuse me. <coughs> Excuse me. Right. Let's see. Uh, yes, I want to watch. Here we go again. So well, now in losers finals, um, after the nano one from winners bracket, um, I can review the video a little bit later, or I can just let it run. But and don't copy starting up with Thunder Dragon to search two more copies of the Let's see what he sets. Um, and there's a trap dash shoot. I mean, he didn't he didn't need to know the knowledge, but he don't copy now gets a chance to to get rid of a card, for, get rid of the the best monster for snatch two in this situation, unless unless there's a reinforcement of the army in the hand. Interesting, yeah. So. Yeah, unsurprisingly, Don's are interesting. I'm surprised that I'm surprised the MSC didn't get chained here. Normally, the betting person would chain the MST here. Um, I thought that yeah, no, okay, fine. So yeah, so Snatch you saying how okay, um, okay, um. It looks like you typed up my whole hand. I don't know which one you've chosen for me. It was clear that Don Zaluk was chosen. Let's see. I won't, um, as a warrior player, you almost have to go MST later <laughs> into what's his face. Unsurprisingly, there's the Phoenix Wing Wing Blast. Um, rotate into Mystic Swordsman, run over the set monster. It'll be pretty pain interesting. He goes for Blade Knight. I guess if you run into Borg and he shuffles, sets 2 to boost the blade up to 2k, runs into. Let's see what he runs into. Does he run into. I should have seen that happen. It is the spy. So now. But. Here's the weird thing is that Snatch Steel. Running Zaborg actually comes in useful <laughs> in this instance. He's saying it's a nightmare, but he's got the perfect means to play both of the spies thanks to Zaborg and Ring if he chooses to do so. So, Don Copy has two Glaive Keeper Spy on field and two Thunder Dragons in hand and three unknowns. I, I wouldn't be surprised. Ooh. Snatch Steel does Snatch Steel Snatch Steel against Snatch Steel. <laughs> do we see the ring here or do we see the solemn? Um, yeah, unsurprisingly, he flipped the solemn. He probably wants to see this. Yeah, now is a bit risk. Could be a bit risky for, but Snatch Steel will probably go for it and go for. Will he? Let's see. He goes for it. Does the attacker with the other spy? And don't copy is basically not dead drawing. Snatch steel. Um, main two. Does he set a card? We know the last set cards the ring. From knowledge of dust shoot, and he's also set a card. Um, Heavy Storm would be pretty nice right now. But yeah, that, that Heavy Storm Chaos Monster is basically a good game here. GG here. But does Don Copy? Nope, he doesn't have it. Does he get hit by Dust Tornado? No, he doesn't. Don't copy is sitting quite pretty. 
Uh, he's got four actual cards and a Thunder Dragon in hand. And Don't Copy is not attacking into a second. He's digging deep into his deck and giving giving extra life to Snatch Steel to make up for the song he played for. Oh wow. Do we see another Solemn here? Yeah. So, yeah, Snatch Do had to keep the Snatch... The, he was probably waiting for Adult Copy to set another monster with that Snatch Deal because Members of Borg is mandatory. So if, if it's the only monster on the field and you try to use its effect, it's gone. It pops itself. Don't copy, just playing it slow. Um, as the turbo player, you want to slow the pace of the warrior deck. And of course, Gravekeeper Spy is one of the best monsters to do that. And do we see another Solemn here from Snatch Steel? There we go, another Solemn. Do we. What do we. Does don't copy leave it? Ooh, wow! Well, there's a this, and there's the solemn to come. Solemn heavy storm, heavy storm solemn is one of the best combinations. Unless, ah, brutal. That's brutal. Yeah. So middle force, he's gonna flip some, flip summon the spy, and that's game. Attack for game. Yeah, just attack for game. There we go. And game one goes to don't copy. So yeah, um I didn't want to give too much away, but don't copy is clearly running Song Judgment. Yeah. And that's that. Is that. Game just now is just a perfect example of why Chaos Turbo likes is trending towards running some judgments. Although we have seen builds that don't run it, um, quite a few few of the few of the well-known Chaos Turbo players are are playing it. So shout out to you guys as well. So let's see. Yeah, it's actually it's being quite liberal with those solemn judgments, and yeah, I, I think as I guess he's he's more he's better. He's he's probably one of the players that probably knows more about when to flip those solemn judgments. So let's see if he's let's see if those sun judgments are going to be used aggressively again. So snatch steel going first. Does he open the door this time? <laughs> let's see. Let's see how he opens with upstart to gain a thousand. And there's the duo. <laughs> 
So he better not complain this time around. He's got the yeah. He better not complain this time around. He's got the duo. Does he have a bit of lag? Because he probably have selected by now. And does Nash deal Summon Blade Knight set four? <laughs> don't don't copy go are you happy now <laughs> oh. see interesting he goes with t set. So for those of you that don't know what T set is, so it's set the most that I set the back hand. And don't copy committing his whole hand straight away. Does he have the yeah, he doesn't have the knight to save it. So he's probably trying to let's see how don't copy navigates this. And the blade drops. Is that the D Warrior Lady set? Or are we going to see the MST? No, sorry, Secret Armor from Snatch Steam. As I thought, it is the Warrior Lady. And pass turn. And Snatch Steel is in a pretty good position. Um, Let's see. So Blade Knight set two, attack for two thousand. He's gonna set two. What does he have? No, interesting. And here goes the second armor from Don't Copy. So yes, we can see uh, Don't Copy is clearly well prepared for the Chaos Turbo, Chaos Warrior, Warrior matchup by siding in Berserk Gorilla and Sakura Drama. Um, so as we saw in the game before, Don't Copy likes, prefers Phoenix Wing Wing Wing, wing Blast. Um, in this spot it's a little bit awkward for trying to deal with the back row but I guess if you're spinning away a dead card anyway then yeah so wing blast is probably better against the real match format but no here's the problem you is the awkward situation you wing blast this breaker and it gets to be used again. <laughs> So he's forced to use a Solemn here. Yeah. Let's see if we see a Solemn from Snatch Steel. He might force it through. Wing Blast. I'm reading that other set card as the Wing Blast. Which is, there's no way you would normally Solemn. Solemn Breaker. Huh. Yeah, so... Yeah, so Magician was dead anyway, but yeah, still copy drew into some recited cards, but clearly, clearly um, Snatch Steel is well prepared, and if he did other storm, he did well to hold it this time around. So, um, yeah, he's got Chaos Fodder, seen no back row, back row removal. And we see a bluff to rotor flipped. That's surprising because you wouldn't. I wouldn't. Oh, he's he's waiting for Don't Copy to to say okay. I don't want to negate. 
Interesting, don't copy in the case. He, he's, he did mention that he's already dead, so let's see. Do we have the solemn here? Do we have the solemn from from Snatch Steel? No, he lets that go. Exile Force will put for a hundred thousand. No dogs, so he's gonna have to normal summon the Koichi if he draws into it and pray to God that there's no separate sound. Unless that's the Sangen. What's well, in the serpent? But any monster, any of the bigger monsters, bigger monsters would see the deal. Unless he's got Zabog. And he's got Zabog Solemn. So he's thinking. So unsurprisingly he tributes. And it is the serpent. Interesting, so So here's the interesting part. Is he going to pass priority? Yes he does. He doesn't play around the trap dust shoot. Look, don't copy doesn't play around the trap dust shoot. Surprised. Wow. Yeah, he doesn't have another song. So yeah, if you're Snatch Steel, you have to stall him here. You've got no choice. You have to give, you have to give Don't Cop, let Don't Cop <sighs> have his dead hand. Of Sins the Serpent and Two Thunder Dragons. <sighs> and look. Ooh, Seven Tools coming in. Negating the Solemn Judgment. Wow. So, don't copy gets a, basically a fresh new hand. But does he draw anything useful? He's going to have to. <laughs> Some gorilla, you've got a swing. You've got a swing. Does he have the Sakuretsu armor? So don't copy needs to have drawn into a back row. He's thinking. Yeah. So Snap Steel is gone. Does Snap Steel top deck the BLS? No, he top something just good. So now we don't pop his back on the clock. But at least he's got Serpent. Uh, unless Snap Steel has got no Cross Crossout. Um, do we see the Heavy Storm? We haven't seen the heavy storm. Yep, so don't copy praying that Snatch still does not draw into something that is with a set monster. Well, just another beat stick, another monster. I'm reading. Let's see, is that Spy or is that Serpent? I reckon it's Serpent. Thinking whether he wants to attack, yes. 
So it's the Knight Assailant. Wow. So that's the dark that don't copy needs. If we've got heavy chaos monster, that would be really strong right now. And he doesn't draw anything, but um, I would bet my money that he's drawn the Solemn Judgment from that sort of. Dust tornado, which one does dust tornado hit? No, you have to target first, so I guess that makes sense. Blade Knight attacks over a uh, serpent. He's thinking whether he wants a mirror force here or whether he wants to use Sakura so armor. I mean, we knew that was a serpent. So there comes the serpent. Does he. Do we see another solemn here? So that for me suggests he's got another Solemn. Snatch still drawing all three Solemns in this game. And he opens the... Yeah. Does Snatch steal? That the oh torrential. Drop the turn. Standby phase. Get the serpent. Main phase one. Two sets. So is that a mill force? Remember, now there is no. So both players have used their son. Have you seen four out of six? Just need that. Serpent. The attack for game. Do we see the third solemn? Oh, wow, what a top deck! So now the spies are going to be. Wow, here comes pot. Do we see heavy BLS? I wouldn't be surprised if Don Copy decides to set a card. So he does a T set, which allows him to play around the trap dust shoot. Let's see how big the download is. Attack of a serpent? No, it doesn't attack of a serpent. 
which is fair enough. Do we see a magician of faith grab back Grace Paternity? I mean, Don Copy is running Knight of Sand into this build, so at least he does get the chance to recycle the Magician of Faith um, by discarding a Knight Assailant. But let's see how. Let's see if we're going to see a Borg here, actually. The Borg would be pretty nice for Snatch Steel. And he just decides to attack. So, what does he attack? Play Knight at 2k, which one does he attack first? Does he attack the new set or does he attack the old set? My money is that he would attack the new. Oh, he attacks the old set, okay. And he gets met by Sakurai's armor. We don't see Sangan attack, so Sangan is likely to. Don't expect don't copy to to summon any monsters. Um, let's see if he draws the heavy storm. Is heavy storm with solemn set? Does he have heavy storm with solemn set? Here we go. That's game. Well played by don't copy. Uh, yeah. I'm surprised he's flexing off now. <laughs> yeah. Damn. So yeah. Great games. Um, yeah, so we're gonna see see I'm going to register that. So I don't know if I think any of the guys go format guys want to hold off and it's quite late anyway, it's touching on eleven o'clock so in Italy, so yeah. Wow, so yeah, just have. Yeah, magic. Incredible top deck. That, that Grave Keeper Spy. Hmm. <laughs> so yeah, uh, Grave Keeper Spy, that was such a great top deck from Don't Copy, and he just was able to write it out until. Yeah, he was able to wait it out. So yeah, good games all. Um, so let's let me just have a quick review of the nano. So just a quick glance. I'm not going I'm going to hide both hands for this one. So pot of green from the nano followed by Thunder Dragon. Upstart T set. Just a quick Overview of even get split, so he just didn't get caught on stream. Surprise yeah, I guess he's surprised he has a yeah, you might as well fire off the duo. So we saw this bit. Yeah. Sorry, yeah. Yeah, we saw this bit. We saw we know that the set card will be blocked. Nothing. So we saw that. Okay, cool. I'm actually going to go back there and save the replay. So, yeah. Uh, yeah, that's the that's Obelisk uh, winners' finals and losers' finals since I couldn't get back in time to broadcast the losers' semi finals. Uh, thanks for watching. And hope you see you on the next one. See you around.